Okay, so now let's go and talk about even, odd, or neither functions. And I guess I could probably have a little comma there. Um, but when determining if a function is even, odd, or neither, the only thing we've really discussed here is it's even if it's reflective about the y-axis, it's odd if it has re-symmetry about the origin, and if it doesn't have either of those symmetries, then it's neither. Now, there is a great algebraic technique to doing this, but we're going to cover that later. So right now, we just want to look at, well, let's look at the graph and let's identify the symmetry. So what I did is I created a link here for you to kind of follow um, on those graphs, or you could just type them into your calculator as well. So let's go ahead and take a look at these graphs and kind of see what type of symmetry are we working with. So we look at the first example here. Um, what it what we have here, and actually this is something that I didn't really plan on doing. So let me actually. Well, uh, yeah, why well, can't. So if we were just to reflect this graph about the y-axis, then it would look something like this. Right, so you can see that the graph is being reflected by the y-axis, but it's not exactly the same, right? So therefore then what we wanna do is kinda of say, all right, well, how would I reflect it then again about the the y-axis, so therefore making this now going to be um, a negative. And if you see, if you put this in negative again, if you reflect this graph about the y-axis, which would basically mean plugging a negative in for there, what you would get is the exact same graph, right? So you reflect it, you reflect it, um, and that's exactly what that graph would go ahead and look like. So here you can see that the um, function has a symmetry about the origin, so therefore since it's symmetrical about the origin, it is odd. All right, next example is y equals 3 to the x. So let's go and take a look at that one. And this one you can see, hopefully, I mean, I don't really need to do much work here. You can see that this obviously everything to the right of the y-axis is exactly the same as everything to the left of the y-axis. So therefore, this function is symmetrical about um, the y-axis. So therefore, it is even. And then last but not least, we could probably make an assumption it's going to be neither. But let's just go and take a look at it, make sure. And you can see, yes, this graph, even though it does have a line of symmetry, it's not a line of symmetry that's about the y-axis. So therefore, that is an example of uh, neither, because it is not even, nor is it odd. And again, as I mentioned, what we'll be doing is, um, later on, we'll be showing you the algebraic technique, where you could probably uh, do all of these functions without even having to look at the graph. So it can be powerful, but for right now, I just want to kind of look at, you know, understanding the even, odd, or neither when regards to symmetry. So there you go.